Okay, we're good. At 1,100. 1,100 for Deborah. Dan, did you get yours up and running? I don't have my 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 fake Fitbit on, so I'm going to have to rely on my uh, cell phone app. And so cell phone app. That's another option. I'm at 288 steps so far. I'm just ripping. So everybody, remember your start, your starting steps. The app this works. Is basic. Works best if you have the cell phone with you. You have to have it on you, though. Yeah. Good morning. I'm Cindy. Here we have Deborah. And over here we have Tim. Team TCF. Yeah. Woo woo. All right. Thank you for joining us, all of our faithful followers. <coughs> Take it wide. And narrow. So I'll call this one basic. Back to basic. Go wide. Hope everybody's having a great morning. Basic. We'll do two more. We're taking it to a wider step. Go back up just a tad. There we go. Take it wide. Back to basic. Perfect. I'm going to do one more of these. Side step, toe tap, 
alternating one side and then back to the other. So take it back and forth. Whatever you want to do with your arms is up to you. You can add weights. You can carry little hand weights. Perfect. Let's do two more. Last one. Go back to basic. So we stepped off one side as the leading leg. And we'll go to the other side. Side step, go tap. After this class, we're going to have 10 a.m. pop yoga. It's always a burner <laughs> of many different body parts. <laughs> Oh, and then what do we have after that? Ooh, we got the lattes. Is the gym Nazi? Gonna kick your abs. The Abnihilator is gonna be in the house. <laughs> the Abnihilator. Yeah, the Abnihilator. <laughs> Go back to basic. Let's take it wide. Bring those knees out to the side. A little waddle, waddle, walk. <laughs> Moving to travel, so I'm all the way forward, travel backwards, and forward. Get our steps, move it back. What side of your body, which leg are you focusing on? The right. Yeah, we have a dominant side, so even it out. Focus evenly on each leg, each foot. Because we step predominantly a little more forcefully with our favorite side, dominant side. Let's do one more back and then forward. That's basic. Perfect. Giving myself a little more room. Moving into a Z. No, let's make it a V. So we're going to step diagonally out to the side, bring it back to center, step to the back. So we're creating a V step out laterally, out to the side instead of forward. This is training. So you could, when you step, Back to center, you could do a little pop step maybe. So let's take it. Little pop. Or not. Just getting those extra muscles. The other leg. <laughs> and the brain. Brain game. That's a big So you're making a V out to the side. Let's do one more forward and back. Back to basic. Got it. Other side of the body. We're going to start with the training steps. So a lateral V forward and out to the side, back to center, back. Forward and back. 
One more coming up. Back to basic. Perfect. So we did lateral off to the side. Now we're going to do that V step to the front. Stepping it out, 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 in, in. Training. Remember which one is your leading leg that you're starting off with. We'll change it up and go leading leg on the other side. All right, pick up the pace. almost halfway there, pushing your first mile. Goes by pretty quick. Goes. All right, we're going to do that V step towards the front. Other leg will be the leading leg, so step it. Training. We'll do two more after this for training. One more. Then you're going to pick up the pace when you're ready. Here we go. Five more. I've got half a mile. One more back to basic. Here we go. High knees. Remember, if there's any step that you particularly don't care for, always just go back to basic. Or another step that you do like that still gives you credit for all the steps you're taking. How about traveling with high knees? Forward and back. Gonna do two more. Breathe in a little harder. One more. Forward, all the way back, back to basic. Slow those feet down. We're gonna quiet the feet, we're gonna check in. See where you're at. 2,475 for Deborah. 1275. 1275 for Tim. Using an app on his phone. I got up late today. So. <laughs> no worries. Really good. Okay, hey, we're gonna do that little zigzag step. So I'm gonna come forward. I'm gonna take a step out to the side, feet together. Out to the side, feet together. So it's gonna Zigzag. So one, two, three. Three, two, one. Another training. And when you're ready, pick up the pace. Here we go. Got it. Oops. Don't lose your place. Like a sewing machine zigzag. <laughs> How long has it been since any of us have used a sewing machine? Good it's ages for me. Two years. Two years for Deborah. I can't even remember. When we take it out, get it set up, put it away. Put it away. That's yeah. it. Let's do two more. Forward and all the way out. Here's one. You got it. One more. Back to basic. Perfect. So I remember they had those toy sewing machines that you could use glue. It was 
for little girls, little kids, and you would just sew, and it would glue fabric together. And I had wanted one so bad, my mom went to the yard, a yard sale and bought me a real sewing machine instead. She probably paid a lot less money, and I had just as much fun with it, plus I actually sewed things for real. <laughs> Basic steps. So we're going to try the other side. So how's that going to work? We went this way, that way, that way. And we're going to switch it the other side of the body, I think. How's that going to work? Oh, my goodness. <clears throat> Start from here. Here we go. This way. No, that's the same. Dang it. No, it's not. There we go. Training. Okay, talk about brain games. Three. If it feels exactly like the first zigzag you did, you gotta switch it to the other side as the leading side. Perfect. So we're going to do two more after this. Here we go. That's one. Here's two. Back to basic. Okay, I was thinking about a pivot. One leg is going to stay as a pivoting leg and see if we can step around in a circle with our other leg and still get credit for steps. So we're going to step out, out. So your pivoting leg is the center. Got to make a little pop step with the center pivoting leg. Let's do one more circle. Beautiful. Back to basic. How'd you do? About 10 steps. All right, beautiful. Now we're going to step out with the opposite leg. Here we go. And circle. Pivoting leg. One stays in the center. We circle around it. Two times total. Getting steps. <laughs> there you go. There's one. Beautiful. Back to base it. Feeling like summertime weather out there. Yeah. It's going to be pretty warm today, I, I assume. 96. 96. Oh, that is summer. It's starting to feel like summer in All right. Too. We had the first day of summer already, right? On the 21st? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So it's officially summer. We'll do that skater. So get ready. Training steps first. So step it diagonal behind. Nice and easy. Get your balance. If you need a chair or something in front, you can hold on even to a walker. Get those steps in. Get that body moving. When you're ready, let's pick up the pace. Here we go. And get those arms swinging like they need to. There you go. So just imagine skating. Remember that was the young teeny bopper activity. Everybody go to the skating rink. I live down in Highland, San Bernardino area. Perfect. I got more of the outside too. Woohoo! Remember, if you wanted to really bump it up, you could wear hand weights, ankle weights, up to you. You can make it as intense 
or mild or moderate as you'd like. Let's do one more each side, back to basic. And breathe. Leg kicks coming up, kick it forward. Here we go. Draw that belly button back in towards your spine. And breathe. If you want, kick a little high. Your low back's ready for it. Getting pretty warmed up here. Bring it down. Kick it. Kick it. Change the angle of the kick. Kick diagonal, diagonal, across the front. You got it. Only if you're ready for it, though. Remember, all of these are suggestions. You do what you can do. Listen to your body. Here we go. We're going to go back to basic. Here we go. Perfect. So we kicked forward, we're going to kick backwards, so those hamstring curls or butt kickers, arms, you want it to be more in your shoulders, lift those arms, elbows a little higher, and upper back. Beautiful. Hold that tummy tight. Let's do two more each side, one more. Back to basic. Yep, new fan. Can we kick back with more of a straight leg? Okay, be careful on this one. Let's try it. Kick, straight leg. Kick it. You ever see your dog out in the yard? <laughs> kick it back. Kick it back. Kick up that dust. <laughs> That's it. Straight leg. A little different there. Yeah, it is. Let's do two more each side. One more. Back to basic. We have a good five minutes left before we bring it down and we can do a little stretching at the end now that everybody's all warmed up. So with one leg, we're gonna start out, we're gonna step forward, we're gonna step out to the side, and then we'll step to the rear. Training coming up, quiet those feet. Here we go. Forward, side, back. So let's keep it continuous. So forward, side, back, Side. Pick up the pace when you're ready. Here we go. You can do a little pop step. That's it. We're going to do two more. This is one. One more. So Here, we go. <laughs> Here we go. One more to the front, back to basic. Perfect. How'd you do? Not good. <laughs> I'm going to jail. Engage the brain. <laughs> brain body connection. Yeah. All right, so we have our feet taking softer steps. Let's check our Fitbits. 
or our our devices, I should say. Where are you at? 37, 90, and I started at 8 something, 830. Deborah? 3,800, started 30, at 11. 800, started at 11. Tim? Uh, 2065. 2065 for Tim. Nice. So we have the other side of the body. Training steps. No. Here we go. Forward. Five. Back. There you go. If you're ready to step it faster, right off the bat, go for it. All right, here we go. Move it. Little pop step. Music. The beat on this one's a different. A little bit different. Got it? Woohoo! We got it. We're going to do two more. Now, that's one. Here comes the second one. Back to center. Beautiful, basic. So as we're marching in place, stepping in place, let's bring our arms up, take a nice big breath. Breathe it out. Two more. Keep stepping. One more. Beautiful. So I, I wanted to talk about pivoting regarding our mental thought processes. So we can, whatever we focus on, we attract more of. Thoughts are like streams and rivers, so there's bodies of thoughts. We can just kind of hook up with uh, whatever stream or river we're currently accessing by our thoughts. Pivoting, so if we're thinking about something that we don't like, Pivoting is turning away from that thought and focusing on something we do like. So let's do that pivoting step again. So say the negative thoughts over here. Let's pivot. Let's go away. Away. There you go. Gladly. All right. Beautiful. Bring it back. Okay. So say there's a positive thought that we like but we're pivoting away from it. That's not too good. Bring it back. So there's that positive thought. Well, let's pivot back towards the positive. Beautiful. Back to basic. It's like going down the street. So if you go through some of the dirt roads out here in the desert, the desert is so beautiful. Sometimes, we might just focus on the trash that we see. But all we have to do is look to the other side of the road and there's no trash over there. So you, you know, riding your horse, your quad, your bike, whatever, walking your dog, just look over there. Pivot away from the trash. Look to the beauty of the desert. Nice. So it's a training. We have to train our brains. It's not always easy but it's possible. All right, let's travel forward and back. Forward. News, news, news. Well, watch something beautiful, pleasant, lovely, worthy. One more time. Back to basic. 
everything is energy. So our thoughts are a bunch of energy just zooming around. We have to harness that energy. Unpollute, you know, the rivers, the streams. Keep it clean. Guarding our gates, what we watch, what we listen to, what we speak. All right, slow it down. Focus on your right foot. Focus on the ball of your right foot. How about the heel? Heel your right foot. <laughs> uh huh, that changed my gait. Yeah. <laughs> Even it out from the toes all the way back to the heel. Focus on that right foot. All right, shift your focus, shift your awareness. You can do the same thing, this is training the brain. Focus on the right, the left foot, I'm sorry. The toes and the ball of your left foot. Feel it. Keep that brain engaged. Bring your awareness to your heel of that left foot. Press it a little harder, <laughs> a little more with purpose on the heel. All right, bring your awareness and even it out from the toes all the way back through to the heel of your left foot. Beautiful. Even it out. Can you make both sides of the brain engage? Step evenly. Got it. Awesome. Leg kicks, very soft, forward. And breathe. Just another minute. You're pushing your two mile mark, I'm sure. And breathe. Breathe it in, breathe it out. Can you kind of kick that leg out to the side? Kick it, kick it, kick it. Shake a leg, shake a leg. You got it. Shake it out, get it off there. Bring it back to basic. Let's move our arms up toward the ceiling, slightly forward. Bring it back in, cactus. Reach up, cactus. One more time. Back to cactus. Let's bring it close to our sides, fists at our shoulders, sit it out. with our staff so well. Just want to let everybody know we have an alternative um, version of these classes that can be uploaded to YouTube. So check it out. Check it out. Check, 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 check. 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 Yeah. 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 Ye
So if you're still there, 4,800 for me, Deborah. I'm at, I'm sorry, uh, 4,820. 2676. Woo-hoo! All right, everybody.